Welcome Aspiration, or MVA, is a safe and effective procedure for removing uterine contents for induced abortion, spontaneous abortion, post-abortion care, or incomplete abortion. MVA should be also accessible where medical abortion services are provided, in the event of failure or for managing complications. The first devices were developed in the early 60s with development of a plastic flexible cannula and manual vacuum aspirator system for uterine evacuation. With the United States Agency for International Development, the IPAS MVA was developed in 1973 and was widely used in the 1990s across 100 countries worldwide. Manual vacuum aspiration can be performed by a trained mid-level healthcare provider in an office or examination room. And more than 98% of women will not require further treatment. The procedure takes around 15 minutes, depending on gestation, and can be performed under local anesthesia with the patient being able to go home as soon as she feels good after a short recovery time. Dilation and curettage is usually performed in an operating theater by a physician and requires specialist skills to administer general anesthesia or deep sedation. This will also be the case for women who choose um, general anesthesia or sedation for their uterine aspiration procedure. Delivery of MVA in the outpatient setting with local anesthesia and destruction techniques has the advantage of avoiding this admission. General anesthesia and sedation may also require an overnight stay. Operationally, this would lead to increased waiting times to the procedure, thus decreasing access early in pregnancy. This early in the pregnancy not only positively impacts on the patient, but also leads to cost saving for the healthcare systems. Other gains are the reduction in cost for admission with advantages of not using general anesthesia and less reliance on electricity supply. Another advantage is the possibility to perform tissue inspection after the procedure. Vacuum aspiration is a recommended technique for surgical abortion for pregnancy up to 12 to 14 weeks of gestation by WHO. Dilation and curettage is an obsolete method of surgical abortion and, if it's still practiced, should be replaced by vacuum aspiration. DNC is less safe than vacuum aspiration and considerably more painful for women. Vacuum aspiration is quicker and associated with less blood loss than DNC, and the major complications of DNC are two to three times higher than those of vacuum aspiration. Giving all these benefits of MVA to the patients and to healthcare systems, each service delivery point should consider how access to MVA integrates with existing gynecological early pregnancy termination and emergency services.